Good morning, children. Welcome to the Narayana Life Classes. This is the Maths Revision Assignment Three Explanation. The first question is the first question is in the question first three questions study the pattern and following the steps we have you have right. And first question is one into eight plus one is equal to nine. One into two twelve into eight plus two is equal to nine eight. One two three into eight plus three is equal to nine eight seven. So one two three four into eight plus. So up to here they are given. So next two steps they are asking. One two th one two three into eight plus three is equal to nine eight seven. Next two three uh, two steps we are taken as one two three four into eight plus four is equal to nine eight seven six. One two three four five. Into eight plus five is equal to nine eight seven six five. If you wanted to multiply, multiply and add, you have to get this one only. And next one is second question as ninety one into eleven into one is equal to one double zero one. Ninety one into eleven into two is equal to two double zero two. Ninety one into eleven into three is equal to three double zero three. Ninety one into eleven into four is equal to four double zero four. They are given the four steps. We have to follow the next two steps. So what are the next two steps? Means ninety one into eleven into up to here the following pattern one two three four five into five and one double zero one two double zero two sequence it is following so which is five double zero five. Same like the following the next step is ninety one into eleven into six is six double zero six. So these are the next two steps for this question, and these two are the next two steps for this question. Okay. And the third question is one forty three into. Seven into one is equal to one double zero one, and one forty three into seven into two is equal to two double zero two. One forty three into seven into three is equal to three double zero two. So again, same like the first and two questions, we have to follow the next two steps. One forty three into seven into four sequential order one two three four. Same like the one two three four four double zero four. And next two steps they are asking one forty three into seven into five, which is equal to five double zero five. These are the next two steps. And next question is how would you multiply? How would you multiply sixty five by ninety nine mentally? So you have to multiply sixty five by ninety nine with mentally sixty five into ninety nine can be write as hundred minus one. So, which is the distributive property? Distributive. In the class, we learned the distributive property. A into B minus C, which is A into B minus A into C. Sixty-five means six thousand five hundred. Sixty-five into hundred is six thousand five hundred minus sixty-five. So, you have to subtract this one. You will get the answer as six four three five. Six four three five. This is the fourth question, and same like the fourth question, we are having the fifth question also. Fifth question also. How would you multiply? How would you multiply one three six eight zero three four seven by nine? Here, given one is ninety nine. Here only the nine. With the nine, you have to multiply this number. So same like that. One three six eight zero three four seven is nine. We have to write on as the ten minus one. So same like the distributive property is following. So one three six eight zero three four seven into ten minus minus one three six eight zero three four seven into one. So you are multiplying one three six eight zero three four seven zero minus one three six eight zero three four seven. So you have to subtract these two. You will get the answer as one two three one two three one two three. This is the pattern. Okay, children. This is the explanation of the maths assignment trick, children. Thank you and have a nice day.